like subscribe and comment if you haven't already as a disclaimer I'm not sponsored by any of these brands or companies. You good? Yo, what's up guys? This is Stefan Sandoval. Right here, I got this new Powell Flight Deck set up right here. I've never tried these boards before. I actually used to work at Powell. Thanks to Jersey Mike that he sent me one. He hooked it up and I'm really hyped on these boards and I can't wait to try it out. So this is a size 8.25 Powell Flight Deck. That's tight, huh? Goes with the sticker. And also, you can't forget about that solo grip. Solo grip. At solo grip tapes, I also did some custom artwork, you know, just to stand out from the rest. And yeah, I'm about to head up to San Bernardino right now for a skateboarding contest. Six stars event hosted by Ruben Nehera. And I can't wait to go and check it out. See you there. update on my Pal Parata flight deck. I would say the only problem about this about these boards is that they get razor tail easily. It feels so solid still. Like honestly I don't feel a difference like like I said like just razor tail. But the pros about this board 
is that it's really light and it could take an abuse. And I'm gonna leave in the description all the details, you know, the specs, you know, about these boards. There's a situation where I landed in the middle of the board like this, you know, down the decent sized set. And you know, if you have, you know, your traditional wooden wow. board, it would have been broken. But this board, it did not break. Seriously, it did not break. Like, I landed straight in the middle just like this, but I bet, like, it was, oh, it was, I was like, what the heck? You got to try them out for yourself. I want to shout out to Jersey Mike for blessing me with this board. I have to say that these boards are really 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 great I even bought a brand new one right here just to prove how good they are this is also a flight deck construction Steve Caballero check it out yeah I love Dragon Ball Z so the whole you know Dragon Ball theme I love it these boards are $80 and I say they're worth every single penny
stay tuned. Here at Carmel Valley Skate Park, San Diego, California. Getting a session, it's been raining these past couple of days. Finally getting a sesh. Just warmed up, and I try to film a few clips of myself. Just got done skating this part. On to the next. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> I want to give a quick shout out to Jersey Mike. And Overcast Skate Shop, Robert at Overcast Skate Shop. Appreciate it, fellas. Thank you. Still riding this Pal Prato Flight Deck right here. This thing is already torn to shreds already. Look at that. And I put a crack in it. I don't know if you can see. I think I put a crack in it already. This board is just, this board is done, so. These boards are really good, though. I highly recommend it for. I mean, yeah, for the price, it's $80, but I've been skating this thing for about four months now and it's still holding up. I want, I want to set this up right now, but I don't think I'm going to have time to skate, so I think I'll just save it for another day. I'm in Lake Elsnow right now. About to go head up to skate park over there. Let's get it. Make sure you follow Pal Peralta and Mini Logo Skateboards. They make great, great products. Highly recommend, highly recommend it. Clips at Lake Elsinore Skate Park. <laughs> to make the skate park, can't skate it because it's bike session. I mean, nobody there. The skate park is not that good, anyways. But I found this roller rink, or ice rink right here, whatever you want to call it. Practicing some flat ground right here. Nice smooth ground. I'm down to film a 5 -0 flat, let's get it. So let's get in this thing right here. Power Pro to flight deck. Get one. These things last. Solo grip, get yours. This board is falling apart on me. Still good. Flight deck. Just got done doing the five on flat. These bars are so good. I don't know how much I have to say it, even though it's all beat up still, but it still puts in work. Just pulled up to Encinitas Pools Park, Encinitas, California. About to get a session, but before that, gotta set up this board finally. So a low grip tape. 
gonna put this thing to rest. Thank you. Highly recommend these flight decks. They're super good, super durable, and they last a long time. They're pricey, but hey, you pay for what you get for, right? Just set this board up right now. Me logo all day. The solo grip. Escape Foods Park, get some clips. All right, shout out to these dudes right here for buying grip from me and also filming me. I appreciate you guys. What's your guys' name? Uh, my name's Noah. Uh, make sure to follow my Instagram, Noah.clear, C L A R. My name's Gavin, and uh, my Instagram is Gavin underscore Wilson223. All right, heck yeah. I appreciate you guys, man. Thank you guys so much, dude. Appreciate you. Heck yeah, man. Boom. Boom. Thank Pop you. yourself some solo grip. Yeah, thank you. Appreciate it. Oh, yeah. Thank yeah. you. You already know what it is. I don't know about you guys, but I'm loving San Diego. It's just beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. Compared to the desert, this is paradise. Hope everyone stays blessed. Happy holidays. I'm gonna give you my conclusion on my power plant to flight deck. I'm gonna jump straight into it. You don't have to think twice about your board because it's just that durable. And for me, this board for example, I barely I barely put a crack in it right there and I was still able to skate it do back lips do back big spins from board to fakies and, and I could feel the board bend but it wouldn't break this, that's why right here thanks to Jersey Mike right here for hooking me up with this one and the rest I purchased the cons of this board now yes the price is $80 but I mean you're gonna get for what you pay for because these decks right here I've skated for at least over five months and this one right here is the most beating up one right here you see and if i really wanted to i, I could still skate it but as you can see it's just completely demolished i have my little brother's skateboard right here and he used it basically all summer and longer than that and he's a beginner so he's gonna have a bunch of chips you know from bailing in from his tricks and stuff like that but I mean, other than that, he was still able to pop his tricks and, you know, just like I said, not think twice about his board breaking or not falling apart, nothing like that. So that's one thing I really like about this product is that, you know, like I said, you don't have to think twice. This board is just that good. But if you can't afford an $80 skateboard, then get yourself a mini logo skateboard. This is underneath the Skateboard Corporation branch. And these boards are, you know, a cheap price point board. 100% hard rock maple wood. It's a little bit heavier than these boards. You know, these boards are a little bit lighter. This is a five ply, and this is your traditional seven ply. So this one's gonna be a little heavier. But I mean, hey, it's I've been skating this board for about maybe about two, three weeks now, and you can see like no pressure cracks, no nothing. And yeah, if you can't afford an $80 board, get yourself a mini logo skateboard deck. And yeah, this concludes 
my review of the Pile Prats of Flight Deck and the Mini Local Skateboards. I appreciate everyone for watching. Like, subscribe, and comment. Thank you for watching again. Stay skateboarding, stay blessed. Have a good one. Fly higher, land safe with the Pile Prats of Flight Deck.